Well again, I've decided to do another quick little video of actually installing Mod Organizer and SKSE since I've had a few questions about Mod Organizer and the overwrite folder not being created. So I'm doing a full install from scratch. I've deleted Skyrim completely and only re-downloaded it with Steam. I haven't done anything else yet. So once this is finished doing its thing, you can close the launcher. You, don't, you need to do this step for Mod Organizer and SKSE to properly be redirected to your install. On a side note, please don't install Steam or any of its games in the program files directory. It's just a bad idea and you run into a lot of problems with administrative privileges. If you have a separate drive, I recommend installing it there. If not, right in the C drive is better than program files or anywhere else in the C drive really. Just stay away from program files. Now I'm going to install uh, SKSE, the link's in the comment. SKSE is required for most mods and has to be installed outside of Mod Organizer or any other or or mod organizer. Alright, that's it for the SKSE. You can download it manually if you want to. There is, on their website, they do have uh, just a zip, but I'd rather, I just use the installer. It's much simpler. Alright, now I'm going to install Mod Organizer. Just leave this as you want. You can also set the handle Nexus links. You can do it in the settings as well if you want. And again, don't install this in the program files here. I personally always install it in, uh, right in my, I have a separate games directory, so I'm going to install it here. Alright, now we're just going to run it and see if everything went okay. Now if this comes up, it's usually because you have another install of Mod Organizer. If this doesn't come up, don't worry about it. Alright, okay. You can do a tutorial if you want to, but I've used this program for quite a long time. So I'm going to skip that. Okay, now that you're here, if you have SKSC in this drop-down menu, you've installed everything right so far. And that's where I'm going to end this video today. I think I'm going to do some more videos. Uh, probably breaking apart my first video into shorter, more manageable segments. Alright, see you later.